All right, welcome back to Mass Effect Free Citadel DLC. Brooke? Commander, Edie and I have been analyzing those drives. I think we found something if you're ready. Let's hear it. Though the data's root structure was erased, the logic integrity remains viable. Edie has an incredible talent for this stuff. I know she's an AI, but even still. We found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. Legends can be good or bad. Which are we? You're the kind that people look up to. The kind they owe their lives to. But how come everyone's always shooting at us? I think it's mostly you, Rex. The bigger the target, the bigger the, uh, target. You're saying I've gained weight? It just means there's more of the legend to love. And the camaraderie, the friendship? I think that's your secret weapon. It's all just part of the job. Wait. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? Here we go. Wow. Those marks who were after you, they bought a lot of weapons. Like, big ones. Max, what do they need with that kind of firepower? It appears this drone is preparing to rebel. I have just monitored the Commander's Spectre access code in use at the Citadel Archives. Punch it up. The Archives are going into emergency lockdown. Where is hacking your records is there right now? What do we know about the place? Council keeps sensitive historical information there. Real hush-hush. Even my old CSEC clearance never got me in. Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let's... What's with the Volas? Oh, pizza delivery guy. I got the munchies. <sighs> Double pepperoni. These archives are huge. You'll have a lot of ground to cover. Shame you can't bring everyone. Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Hell yeah, but uh, who gets to take point with you? <clears throat> Who's going to pay the bill? Okay. Right, well... Wait, wait, wait... I'll bet you can't change his appearances. <laughs> Alright, let's see what weapons we get. At Shepard, Rex. Katana, really? I'm gonna give him a piranha. Now I know Rex would probably be better suited with I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, thresher maws. But don't hang out too long. Pretty soon you'll be making friends with Asari. I heard that. The archives are somewhere below us. It could be pretty tricky to get in there. Not really. Oh, 
Krogan first. See you at the party, princesses. Yes, they do. That's enough. Drop your weapon, so this won't end well for her. You bastard. All right. Whatever you think you're getting away with. There's nowhere you can run, nowhere you can hide, where we can't find you. I... why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. Uh-huh. So that's how it's gonna be. Who are you? You weren't the only Shepard that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. Where did you come from? The same DNA as you. A clone. Cerberus spared no expense resurrecting you. With me, I was created for spare parts in case you needed another arm, or a heart, or a lung. Where have you been this whole time? In a coma, until I woke up six months ago. While you were in a jail cell on Earth, I was learning to be human. Amazing what a person can do with enough neural implants. I don't care who you claim to be. The role of Commander Shepard's already filled. By the wrong man. It's time the understudy had his day. Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why do you want to kill us? Because I don't have his memories. I'd never fool my supposed friends. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of Shepard. Like you, Prothean. How many of your own men did you crawl over to make sure you survived? You are just a pale imitation of the real thing. I'm the real thing perfected. I'm you without the wear and tear, Shepard. The doubts, failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one will ever believe your Shepard. They will when I'm flying his ship. This is Shepard. Initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitted command codes now. Good idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep the Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. I'm setting the command codes now. Acknowledged. We'll get underway. Never thought I'd say it. But I'm looking forward to killing myself. I guess ominous threats of violence run in our DNA. But mine is more than a threat. Execute them. The cult of Shepard ends today. That heavy tore me to shreds. Well, he had. We still got everyone? I'm okay too. 
as everyone else. There's some heavies there. into the archives. Stay in your groups. Team Mako, you're on point. Right. What's a Mako? Something we could use right about now. Team Hammerhead, cover the flank. Got it. And the Mako's got nothing on the Hammerhead. At this point, anything's possible. You mean like strolling along and bumping into your clone? I don't want to talk about it. At least not until everyone has ingested alcohol. How are we gonna find anything in this place? Glyph! Yes, Commander? Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? He looks like me. Then I have found the target. No, Glyph. It's another me. Now get going. At once, Commander. Got it. Fighting your own clone. Who would have thought? Still good to have. 
Don't want to do something? You get them to. Hey, Shepard? I don't want to talk about it. Why shoot something once, when you can shoot it 46 more times? The other me can't be far. Keep up the pressure and we'll try to surround him. Let's move. Year 2157 CE. First contact war, Turian interrogation, Vault T-91. Sir, we captured this human in the occupation of Shang-Chi. A human? You're the first I've met. And you're the first bird I've met. He was armed with this weapon, sir. How primitive. Your kind expects to win a war with this. A bullet is a bullet. Year 2157 CE. First contact war, Turian interrogation, Vault T-91. Sir, we captured this human in the occupation of Shang-Chi. Think about all the history stored in this place. Must stretch back thousands of years. Also known as a nap. I'm glad I slept through it all. I just wonder what the other me is looking for in here. Krogan Rebellions, attack on Council, Vault K-306. This is the only visual record of Krogan Overlord Kardec's attack on the Council. Audio follows. I've heard enough. If the Krogan hadn't taken on the Rachni, you would all be at their mercy. You won't give us what we deserve, and so you force us to take it. We will never leave the planet of Lucia, no matter how much the Asari cry. Ambassador Critic, you only weaken your case with this show of violence. Wrong, Solarian. Now our case is finally strong. Negotiations are over!
comedians can start hitting something? You know that the castle was never up. Standing by for your <laughs> Keep pushing ahead. Find him again. Stupid machine. Year 2183 CE. Battle of the Citadel. Geth Dreadnought attack. Vault X5. In the opening minutes of the attack, you'll see that Zakaro Ward is almost completely destroyed. Interrupting. Spectre status recognized. Commander Shepard. The following information is classified. The unknown aggressor is suspected to be a Reaper aided in its attack on the Citadel by Rogue Spectre Saren. The Reaper Sovereign is destroyed by the Fifth Fleet. Malfunction detected. Please contact maintenance. Okay. Then that was. Ah, love watching those things explode. 
Yes, dead machines are the best kind. Having fun, I see. Soldiers calling themselves Razor Squad is just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor making a company called 3478. Fascinating. I being the actual reasonable one. more ammo in this. Nice. Looks like we're clear. Looks like I saved everyone's ass again. <laughs> Hammerhead and Mako, keep pushing ahead. restrain him. Are we sure of our orders, sir? This is genocide. Sergeant Hout, restrain them both. I'll press the button myself. One day, Solarian, you will thank us. Dispersal commencing. survive? Probably. You're being released. The Council wants you to implement a new special tactics and reconnaissance group. Desk job? No, thank you. This is no desk job. Spectres will be the best of the best. They will operate with impunity and answer only to the Council. You will be the first. Now that sounds like the best job offer in the galaxy. Count me in. 
It appears the other commander has a bad temper. Collateral damage does not concern you. Team Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? Hammerhead, do you copy? There, Team Mako. We'll try to clear a path, Commander. has been uneventful. Pray goddess it remains so. We humbly take this step for all Asari, the destiny of our people forever altered. These creatures that greet us seem harmless but unable to communicate. Preliminary observations suggest that their role seems to be that of some sort of guardian. We will begin our exploration. Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? Mako, where are you? You're 2183CE. First Human Spectre Deliberations, Vault SH-1. Commander Shepard's recent accomplishments are not in question. It's his background that the Council has no knowledge of. Shepard was born on Earth and orphaned in an early age. He managed to survive on the streets until he was able to enlist at 18. Anything from Shepard's military record that you'd like to call out? The Alliance considers Shepard their go-to soldier that gets the job done no matter the cost. Ruthless, calculating, and brutal. Thank you for your presentation and to all who spoke. The Council will render their decision on the suitability of Commander Shepard as Spectre within the day. What's your status? The other you is jamming our radios. Hammerhead and Mako are trying to get ahead and cut him off. But I've been hit and need help. Please hurry. Unexpected. Brooks, the vault sealed us in. Is there an override? I don't see one. Cortez? Brooks? Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. The longer answer involves your friends trapped in Iridium vaults and forgotten for... well... Forever. Others know about this. About you. The Alliance will stop you. 
What do you think, staff analyst Brooks? Will the Alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually work for them. How typical of primitives. Who the hell are you? And do you really think I won't track you down? My name doesn't matter. I never keep the same one for more than a few days. And if the elusive man hasn't found me yet, you never will. Your Cerberus? Was. Mr. Elusive and I didn't see eye to eye. He's a ruthless madman, whereas I'm just... ruthless. Why not come to me? We could have worked together. In a way, we did. I'm the one who put together all those dossiers on your... suicide mission. The Collector Base? There was the Salarian Doctor, the Asari Justicar, the Drell. They were all mistakes. We were a pro-human group who started looking to aliens for help. So I bided my time. And when I found another you who agreed, I woke him up. What was the point of it all? All we really wanted was your Spectre code. I got Shepard. Spectre access accepted. But then you survived the hit and insisted on bringing your damned Asari into it. So I had to tie up loose ends. The arms dealer. Elijah, it's me. We need to talk. What the hell's going on? I swear, if those guns get tracked back to me... They won't. But then your sex bot just had to go and recover the data. So here we are. Forced to... contain the situation. The minute. The second I get out of here, I'm gonna take your head and mount it in the Normandy CIC. Then I'm gonna mount his head next to yours. Then I'm gonna take both of your heads and space them out the airlock. Finally. That sounds very dramatic. And if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd be worried. But you're not Shepard. Not anymore. You had Miranda. I have her. Mine has more bite. It was fun while it lasted. What are you doing? Setting things right. Remember this? You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Except somewhere along the way, you forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have humans. And all I've seen you do is end lives. You're gonna make a lousy me. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gives it its shape, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer, update council records. Subject, Shepard. Human Spectre. Accessing record. Please input new data. Biometric identifier updated. Good day, Commander Shepard. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Normandy needs its captain. So, I should go. Farewell, Commander. I guess this is where legends go to die. <laughs> Refresh my memory. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? He said, I should go. Do I sound like that? As long as I've known you, yeah. I am more concerned with the impregnable vault we've been sealed inside. Once was enough for me. I'm more confident than he is, more in control. With me, it's more like, that's all for now. Spoken like a Krogan. Show who's boss. It is doubtful we have much air left. An hour at most. Or sometimes, I'll talk to you later. Because you know what? I never do. Leave him wanting more. Commander, why aren't you more concerned about this? Hmm? Oh. Glyph, you still out there? Yes, Commander. 
Unlock this damn thing and go find the others. No one steals my shit. Not even me. I've got room for Shepard plus two. And figure it out fast because the other Shepard is stealing my ship. What? Oh, I was hoping to go. As did I. It seems I rarely get picked. Joker will come back for you. I promise. All right, let's head on there. This is why I hate Shorely. I swear you parked the ship for five minutes. Can you contact Citadel Flight Control and get them to deny the departure request? Try. All the comm lines in the area are jammed, probably to make it easier for them to steal my ship. We'll stop them. If they get the Normandy, we can still contact the Alliance directly, right? You can prove you're the real Shepard. No, he changed the logs to make his biometrics the official ones. We can't prove anything. Yes, that. And we all just agreed it'd be easier to not let Shepard's evil clones steal the Normandy? One way or another, we're taking this bastard down. Damn right. You go kill the crap out of you. you. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. Any closer and they open fire. Get back and pick up the others, ASAP. Right, they can't have gotten far. Unless they called a cab or something. Here we go. Good. I needed to kill something. <laughs> I got
Okay. Checks. They just gun the engine and go? Most of those checks are just to make the captain feel better. Thanks for letting me know. Send a warning to the Normandy. We can't. Toes are jammed, remember? Damn it. Discharge for conduct unbecoming. You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. I can't fire you without a disciplinary hearing, trainer. And really, the first thing you grab is your toothbrush? It's a Scission Pro Mark IV. It uses Mass Effect fields to break up plaque. And someone just threw me off the ship. If it wasn't you... A, a clone. On when you serve on the Normandy long enough, you'll get used to things like this. I can explain more later. For now... It's sealed. No time to cut through. They're about to leave. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? No. I was only there because I helped with the Normandy retrofits back on Earth. Everyone else is on shore leave. I need another way onto the ship, and I need it fast. There's an emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right here. Manual lock. And it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? Hell if I know. If you could do fine-tuning with biotics, maybe you could trip it with a mass effect field. If you told me this morning that a toothbrush was going to save the Normandy, I'd have been very skeptical. standing right in front of you. Are we clear? It's better this way. Wouldn't you rather take him down yourself? Armory. Find him. Slow him down. Pretty sure we broke Trainer's toothbrush getting the hatch open. Remind me to reimburse her for that. Hey, Shepard. Reimburse Trainer for her toothbrush. Later. Remind me later. A little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing us up top. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail. Alright, get a patrol going. Find Shepard. The real one. Hey, what do you mean by slow down? We're allowed to kill Shepard if we have to, right? He said slow him down because he thinks we're cannon fodder. Oh, well, shit. Watch out, there you go, the I see. Let's go!
Ski. This is the real Shepard. I need you to lock down the Normandy. Can you help us out? Edie, do you copy? She's offline. They must have disabled her. Let's get to the cargo bay. Please send this to an animal shelter for proper disposal, as a warship is not an appropriate... Oh, that is not a... Okay. You messed with my hamster, guys. Now it's personal. Guys? Were you gonna say something, or...? No, no, I get it. Hard to even find the words. You've been practicing with that shotgun. Still remember the fast reloading trick I showed you? You know, I've taken care of myself for the past few years. I know. I'm old and I worry. Even though my favorite quarrians all grown up and killing reapers. You're like the crazy headbutting uncle I've never had. Unacceptable. You want to stop shooting up my ship? It's not your ship. It will be. I've taken your name, your Spectre rank, even your fingerprints. And then you left me to die. Only I didn't. You think fake fingerprints are gonna fool the Council? Or hack it? How's that big plan looking now? Hatchet squad to the shuttle. Team. Nothing but one more mercenary thug.
A team! You have minions! And you're running out! makes us a perfect target. No, that makes us the bait. Do you want me to drive? No. Shooting at skyscrapers. Damn it. Launch the shuttle and blow that thing out of the sky. Normandy back. And honestly, I'm doing you a favor. Because you don't have what it takes. You hear me, asshole? I'm Shepard! No, you're not. Brooks. 
liked you better when you were funny, Brooks. Look at you. What makes you so damn special? Why you and not me? Hang on! We've got you! <sighs> Thanks. What about this pie jack? You, get off my ship. Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus, they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but Shuttle Guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Normandy. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy-ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high-security facility. Maybe she can give him some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Until you escape. Me? Escape? But I'm not a field agent. Stop. Just stop. You betrayed me and the Alliance in the middle of a war. I was young and naive. Admit it, Commander. You'll miss me. Not at this range, I won't. Uh, maintenance to the shuttle bay? of the squads waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. Appreciate it. Worst shore leave ever. <laughs> Come on. Maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. I don't know about no explosions, but just us sounds perfect. Well, that was a good one. 
So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. A nap? Please. We party down. Well, I gotta get going. Things to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya! Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. I need to unwind. Check out the strip. I'll think on it. Just in case, please allow me to provide you with credits for the purchase of any party supplies, Commander. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait. I'm in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? All right. But if and when I decide to have a party, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Right. No promises. I'm gonna go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Thanks, Cliff. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. I think no one would have invited James if not for that. Alright, Normandy repairs. Okay, let's go to the strip. Let's have some fun. Truthfully, I want to go to the stores. Ah, Zaid. I'll decide. We're happy to fulfill all your household needs. Mm hmm. Alright, the arena. But I'm interested in a store, really. Tickets. Alright, there's a store. I'm just checking to see if there's any stores around here that I can buy equipment from. Alright, that's an arcade. I know Zaid is there. Don't worry about that later. Well, suppose there's nothing uh, over here. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the Normandy. I'm going to upgrade the shit out of the guns that I just purchased because they are really, really powerful. In fact, I believe, like, okay, return to Normandy. If you're gonna play an, uh, right. Mm mm mm. Come 
Commander. Sir. Alright, Quistine here signing out. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and enable notifications.